The Kindle Fire's gone HD and had a rather large overhaul in the hardware department. We compare the new specs with the iPad 3. One of the best things about the newly announced Kindle Fire is its competitive price points. Unfortunately, the larger model won't be available in the UK, but in the US it will cost you $299 for the 8.9 inch model and it's still $200 more for an iPad 3. You can order your Kindle Fire HD today with them shipping on the 20th of November. Amazon's offering is around half a millimetre thinner than Apple's, but although the HD is the bigger Kindle Fire model, its screen is over half an inch smaller than the iPads. The beefed up Kindle Fire will run a Texas Instruments OMAP 4470 processor, and the iPad 3 has Apple's own dual core A5X chip. The Wi Fi version of the HD comes with 16GB of onboard storage, so a huge improvement on the first tablet, and the iPad comes in three flavours 16, 32, and 64GB storage options. The new Amazon tablet will feature better Wi-Fi than before, thanks to dual antennas and dual band 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz band support. Mimo will be a key component of the Kindle Fire HD, which will apparently give the Fire HD 21% faster Wi-Fi than the iPad. The HD comes with a heavily modified version of Android Ice Cream Sandwich, and the iPad ships with iOS 5.1, with an update to iOS 6 imminent. And finally, the Kindle Fire HD has now been given a camera, albeit only a front-facing one for video calls. The iPad has a 5 megapixel back-facing camera, as well as a FaceTime camera on the front. As soon as we get our hands on one of the new Kindle Fire tablets, we'll do our usual speed tests, screen tests and any other kind of tests we can think of, so stay tuned on techradar.com.